As a Linux user, you should know some basic command. That's why today I'm gonna talk about uh, some basic Linux commands. So let's go ahead. So to open your terminal, you have to search terminal type terminal or you can open it by control alt t pressing together control alt t the first command i want to talk about is pwd pwd stands for print working directory if you, this command will tell you your current working directory is for example you can see my current directory is uh, home slash my username so by default i am uh, you in uh, my home directory you can use clear to clear the terminal so the next command i want to talk about is ls ls stands for stands for list it will give you a list you can see uh, my car list yeah my current directory is list you can see your all uh, every file every folder here Uh, so I talk list ls I tapped pwd for working directory print working directory now the next command I want to talk about is cd cd stands for change directory so here you can see my uh, folders if I wanna go to download folder I have to type cd space downloads make sure you use capital d if it's capital cause linux is case sensitive so here you can see my graphical view uh, this is my downloads folder it has a list of folder and file that are in my download folder so you can go your previous directory by typing cd space dot dot you can see we are now in our previous directory what means we are in now our home directory how can we know we are in home directory just type pwd print working directory so you can see we are now in home directory so here is the list now i'm gonna open my go to my root directory to go to your root directory you have to type cd space for slash now i'm in my root directory how do i know i'm root in root directory just type pwd you can see uh, i'm in a root directory and uh, if you want to know your uh, files and uh, folders list have your uh, if you want to have your uh, file and folder list then you can see uh, this is a bin cd rom etc and uh, this folder are in my root directory you can see uh, in beside my graphical view now if i want to go to home directory just i just have to type uh, cd space home and then here is the list of my username and just type cd space my username and that's it now we're a uh, home directory if you, you can see the list of files what are in my home directory so we talked about uh, pwd and we talked about uh, cd change directory we talked about list ls so now let's uh, go to document d directory so just type cd space document and that's it we are now in document directory and you can use uh, cd space dot dot to oh, go to your previous directory so you can see now we are on uh, our previous directory 
and let's go to download directory just type cd space downloads you can use uh, you don't have to type full name downloads just type d o w n and hit tab button actually the rule is when you uh, go into some directory you have to type its location Let's say i wanna um, go into a uh, download directory directory so i have to type uh, cd then space then its full location oops i got uh, some error here you have to type forward slash home actually is this is the location of uh, or address of uh, download but you can see I used uh, CD space downloads to open download directory so how did I do that I do I could do that cause uh, download folder is in my current directory so I don't have to type its full address I just have to type uh, CD then space then the folder name or directory name so let's uh, go back uh, cd space dot dot so let's clear that the next thing i want to talk about is cp cp stands for copy so let's uh, make a document here uh, name let's give a name uh, and i give that i give name here copy so if I type ls and then type to downloads folder then uh, I will find that uh, copy file so this is our file so if I want to copy that file I have to type cp space copy the actually this is the name of the file or uh, something and then space then and then space then you have to type a name or give a name your new file so you can see i got a new file here copy and copy copy see if i type ls you will see that file here so in this way you can uh, copy any file so if you want to delete uh, that file you have to type you just have to type rm and then the file name so you can see the file is gone so in this way you can delete any file so let's rename it copy this file so how do i copy a file that uh, with um, that have a space in its name so if i type cp copy space this space file you can see the target file is not a directory so so how do you do that if you want to copy a file that have uh, space in its name then you have to use double quote then the file name then double quote int and give a new name so you can see i can uh, copy this file using this way in this same way you can also uh, use folder if you wanna go to a, do a folder uh, that have uh, space in its name there is two way of uh, doing that you have to type cp folder you can see if i use uh, uh, cp space folder it's not gonna work i have to type cp folder i have to use this backslash then space then folder in this way you can uh, go into this directory another way is you you just have to type cp then space then double quote folder space you can use the space here and that's it so now you can see you can see we are in uh, folder so let's go back 
and now I'm gonna show you another way third way this is the third way you can use CP space then code folder with space then code int then enter so that's it so let's go back using cd dot dot cd dot dot and type pwd so we are in now in a home directory so we'll today we learned all of this command so let's go to download directory so now we are in our download directory and let's copy this file by using cp space the file name then space and say i wanna copy this file to home so how do i do that if i wanna um, copy this file to home then i have to type cp space the file name then space then the location then i have to type the full location for slash home for slash username then for slash then you can see if i go into my home directory you can see that file here so you can see now we are on a home directory and we copy that file copied that file in our home directory the next command i want to talk about is mkdir what stands for make directory if you want to make any folder or new folder or united uh, untitled folder then you can uh, use that uh, command just type mkdir then the folder name now you can see we got the folder let's type ls and that's it we got that folder here so next the uh, next thing i want to talk about is rmdir what stands for remove directory you can delete any folder using that command so let's type remove directory rmdir space new folder that we created now and you can see it's gone so let's make it again make directory new folder so we got our new folder and let's create a document here so this folder is now not empty so if you use make a, re a remove directory rmdir it you cannot use the command to delete for that folder because uh, this folder got something or some files in it so let's check it rmdir space new folder so you can see fail to remove new folder directory is not empty so how do you delete delete something some folder that got something in it or some file in it so to do that you have to type rm space minus r then space then the folder or directory name so using that command you can delete any file any folder that got something or some file in it so you can see our uh, new folder is gone so using that command you can uh, delete any file that have uh, something uh, so the last command today i'm gonna talk about is man if you use man after space and any command you will find all information about the command so let's see the information of lists so ls list directory content contents and you can use enter to know more and you can use q to quiet so let's type man uh, cp and enter you can see the name is cp copy files and directories and you can see all information about uh, cp command so that's it that's it for today thank you guys thank you for watching if you got any question or any problem you can leave a comment below i'll try to answer you and hope you guys enjoyed that video if you do then go ahead and give me a thumbs up and 
Don't forget to subscribe our channel. Only then you will find our next videos.